with another tutorial. Today I'm going to show you four easy ways to style a pixie. So let's jump in. So for the first style, all you need is a headscarf or your favorite headband. So I've just taken a triangle bandana and I folded it up so it's nice and flat. So what you're going to do is you're going to take the corner and you're going to put that at the back of your neck right underneath that bone. And then you're just gonna pull it straight up to where it fits nice and comfortable. And I'm just gonna take it and I'm gonna tie a knot right here. And then pull it down. And we'll adjust the hair later. But I'm gonna double knot it real quick. And then you tuck in the extra fabric. Fluff the hair to lay over. So for the next style, we are going to do a side rope braid. So what we're going to start out with is I'm going to separate the fringe section. I'm going to put a clip in as a placeholder. And then a little, about like an inch parting in the middle. And then clip back that half. And then you're gonna take what's in the center and you're gonna grab a little spot right at the front. You're gonna split it into two sections like this. And you're going to twist them together a couple times. Then like you would with a regular French braid, you're gonna grab a little bit more hair and you're gonna add that in and keep twisting all the way down. You can also do this one with a regular braid, but I like how the rope braid just kind of goes in with a natural curly texture. And then when you've gotten all the way down to the length, you can set it in with a bobby pin. And I like to go in from the side push it into the braid so that it doesn't show in the hair when you put it back over. So unclip the rest. And I'm going to use a little bit of our Pure Abundance Hair Potion for a little bit of extra volume in that fringe. Just shake a tiny bit right at the roots and it's just going to give a little bit of extra volume. So this next style, we are actually going to start out with straightening the hair. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to comb through to brush out any product that I have and start smoothing the hair. And then you're going to start out with a section on the side. You can clip the rest over. Now that it's all straightened, what you can do is you can choose to part it if you like. I'm going to do a side part right here. And we're going to do a nice sleek style with this. So I'm going to take our Light Elements Texture Cream and I'm just going to get about a fingertip size amount. It doesn't take too much. And you're just going to run it through all of the hair to help it lay down a little bit more nicely and then shape it where you want to see it. You can kind of push 
brush their hair up to get a little bit more volume. And now you have a sleek style. So for our final look, we're going to go with the type of pompadour style. So I'm going to use our Light Elements Shaping Wax. This has a little bit more hold, so it's going to keep your style in place all day. So again, I'm just going to use about a fingertip size amount, and you want to rub it between your hands so that it emulsifies. And then you're going to just run your hands through your hair and really get the product all throughout. And once the hair is thoroughly saturated with all of your styling gel, you can just piece it out wherever you want to see it. So I'm just grabbing a few ends and really running the product through them just to accent the texture and the haircut. And you can do as big and messy as you like or a little bit more tame. You can do off the forehead or leave some pieces down. And I like to scrunch the hair as well to get a little bit more lift. And now you have a textured faux 